What is going on guys? It is a Christmas themed week. We've got the Santa hat out. We're gonna be checking out as many Christmas themed songs as we can between now and Christmas day. So I'm super excited coming in here. We have August Burns Red with actually a new release. This came out last month called Santa Claus is Coming to Town. I'm guessing it's just going to be a cover of the original, but I have no idea. I just know it's gonna be amazing. It's August Burns Red. So I'm expecting this to be very guitar centric and heavy. I'm hoping, I'm hoping. We also have some tier three patrons. We've got Austin, Charles, Ian, Jay Alexander, James, Kevin, Marissa, Matthew, Octavia, and Zachary. I'm ready guys, I'm ready for a Christmas jam. Let's get right into it. Oh uh, yeah, this, this sounds like a cover of the original. Their lead guitars are very noticeable with their tuning. Nice. Nice little intro. <laughs> Code and bang, yeah. I'm wondering if it's just going to be an instrumental now. I think it's just going to be an instrumental. The pop it off though. Freaking drum is so quick. Oh dude, yeah. The guitar is harmonizing. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're jamming. This freaking Jack Santa with the mic on this freaking Jack reindeer. It's all working insane. Drummer is killing it, man. <laughs> wow. This like really nice lead driven breakdown. Get the tambourine. Oh, there's a chunk. <laughs> Never gets old. Dude, that sounds sick. There's so many layers. Back into it. The drummer is going really insane. guys just kind of you know showing off what they can do instrumental wise that was awesome august burns red coming in here with their sort of instrumental rendition of santa claus is coming to town thought it was super fun they do not disappoint when it comes to their guitar work their instrumental work overall always sounds so very cool so many layers drummer was going insane in here i do kind of wish there were some vocals though I do wish there were vocals in here. I think they really could have pulled it off, but I will say 
looking at it from just an instrumental only perspective a lot of variety i think they did a really good job of covering uh the original especially throwing in so many cool uh, lead segments in here almost like some mini solos and even what felt sort of like a breakdown you know they brought a lot of chug there towards the end which was really cool to give it a little bit more of that oomph but still had the lead guitar in on those segments that just gave it that sort of like epicness their guitar work is very like I don't know if it's the tuning or what exactly it is, but it's like as soon as you hear it, you're like, man, that is August Burns Red. It's just like a sound. A lot of bands kind of have like their sound, and I don't know exactly, I guess when someone talks about the sound, it means something different to everybody, but for me, it's it's how their lead guitars sound. It's very, very unique to them. Um, in my opinion, I just thought it was really, really cool. Again, I think uh, I think it would be a little bit better if they had some uh, some vocals in here. You know, Jake popping off with some gnarly screams. But hey, I'll take it. It was awesome. We are in the season. We are checking out anything Christmas related this week. So if you have some suggestions, throw them down below. Um, covers, originals, whatever. I'm gonna try and check out as many as I can this week before Christmas. Just. You know being in the spirit it's that time of year i'm super excited as always guys if you're still here if you're still watching thank you so much and i will see you on the next one